Hello Scorpios, welcome back to I Enigma Scorpio channel. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing your journal reading. Let's see the messages for you. What do you need to know right now? What are the messages? What's coming in for you in the future? Overall messages, love, career, money, health. Everything that comes out in the cards, I will not abstain. I will tell you everything that comes out. So take it as a general message. And if you want a private reading from me, you can reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram and email. And the details are in the description box under this video. And follow my Instagram at inigma.in for all the feedbacks, crystal uh, reels and free horoscopes every month. And I also do white prey based spells. Haha, <laughs> it's good. We have energized pure intention charge crystals for you. And uh, for all the uh, services, you can definitely reach out to me uh, uh, through the details in the description box under this video. I'll repeat Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Mercury, Sun, Scorpio, plus Ross Watchers. First of all, I'm seeing the number seven, which means your being spiritually protected and uh, you are in a protective white light shell white light ball of energy that surrounds you which is um, protecting you preventing you from any kind of evil attack negative attack i'm also seeing you spreading a lot of sweetness around you a lot of positivity around you you're flying you're very slow in taking actions okay but you know that whatever actions you take they should be promising sweet results await so i'm seeing something beautiful something outstanding something that you were expecting from a long time a lot of delays were there but now you will see results happening in your life now you will start seeing positivity positive outcomes positive results or whatever you are doing right now take a leap of faith some of you are too uh, worried about you know what the outcome is going to be if you take this step if you do that if you do this so there are risks but there are plans and you're uh, trying to weigh them whether should you be taking the risk or uh, should you be just like uh, abstaining from uh, trying something new or something different or believing in yourself so the message for you is go ahead go ahead you're going to manifest don't worry if this is something that has come into your mind whatever it is go ahead listen to your gut feeling you might fail but you will not regret that you didn't try it okay i'm seeing you're taking slow steps and so might need uh, to speed up a little bit but at the same time yes go with proper planning and everything will work out just the way you want it okay and then i'm seeing Think on your feet. Guys, you have to always remain humble. No matter how much money, no matter how much success, no matter how much recognition, fame, no matter how um, where you reach in your life, you should always remain down to earth, humble. Because um, you can grow to unlimited um, level, but you can also fall down. Since there is a higher power than any of us, and that is watching us. So never do anyone wrong and never do injustice be sincere with your work and the universe will give back to you in a more sincere form so yes always stay always um stay grounded always stay humble and always keep giving uh whatever money you have like little bit you should donate you should give it to charity okay so good deeds will definitely bring in good results so yes always stay humble this is what i'm seeing and also you don't need to uh show off so be low-key is also what i'm seeing some of you are too young but too high in uh, 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 you know wanting to do something very big you are having big dreams big ambitions okay so somewhere uh, the pride takes over so this is going to be your lesson like whatever you're experiencing if you stay grounded you will see a lot of changes in your life which is in your favor life is telling you uh, uh helping you to think on your feet okay and not fly too high uh in your head take time out some of you are moving towards a switch some of you want to change something nine a nine ten okay so i'm seeing that a new beginning is coming something is coming to a halt something very slow moving something that was not working out for you finally coming to an end i feel you're going to shift from one direction to another positive mindset towards the positive mindset towards the positive path towards a new track towards a new challenge so there is a need for you to take a break before you jump into something new you may need a lot of uh, time a break of uh, to revitalize yourself re-energize yourself because you work really hard so i'm seeing finally you're going to get the fruit of your labor with the number nine over here twice 
and then i'm seeing time for a deep dive wow i feel like some of you are fond of swimming water beaches so you are going out and uh, swimming it could be that it can also mean that you're going to do some big shifts you're going to experience some big shifts in your life big changes in your life you're going within you're learning a lot about um, yourself you're connecting with the higher portal you're opening the portal to spirit realm you're being more aware of you know uh, the world beyond the practical world so i'm seeing you connecting on a deeper level with the universe yes yeah, see now that you've opened the portal and now the spirit has become your guide you're listening to your gut feeling through these spirits they're talking to you and now you're having that eagle eye um, very focused determined and know what you want to achieve in your life tend to small things just take little things at time little steps at times don't like jump because if you're climbing the ladder skipping some stairs you might fall down so uh, take it slow and one step at a time okay so little things will bring in big results so if you feel like oh i can't do this so at least start somewhere at least do something okay give with gratitude yes as i told you charity is going to help you a lot being more spiritual means being more donative uh charitorious and giving i'm seeing that attitude of yours while thinking on at your feet by while being grounded while being down to earth will bring a lot more success and happiness achievements in your life okay so be very thankful for all the things that you have received all the blessings you have received from the universe three of swords yes there is an ending happening there is an ending happening and you will feel like you've started to speed up and you started receiving a lot more uh, recognition maybe you are going to receive a higher status at work there is a good news that uh, you have received that uh, project that will bring in a lot of money some of you are going to get the debt money back some of you are going to uh, receive uh, financial growth abundance i'm seeing a lot of changes in your life finally uh, the problems in your life have ended and you've become super excited to dive into new things in your life something new is in your head you want to plan you've decided but you're not telling anyone okay and you have plan you want to take it slow you want to go one by one i feel this is the right track you're in and a lot of things and a lot of changes that you will see in your life within seven months from today onwards i'm seeing your money will grow so all you have to do is just be disciplined be focused and passionate about your deeds Again, the number seven is highlighted, which means that you're becoming more spiritual and you're becoming more honest in your work. And the ace is telling me about starting something new, a new beginning. And the number three is talking to me about the manifestation. You're manifesting what you envisioned. Yes, you're walking away. You're walking away from disappointments. You're walking away from negative relationships, connections, toxicity, back, uh, back downs or slowdowns or a laid back attitude whatever you think is negative in your life you're walking away from that also bad habits because you know your world is shifting there's something big that's going to come into your life that you have to pay attention to some sort of a recognition you might get a lot of success in your field of work you could be a scientist you could be a doctor you could be an entertainer i'm seeing whatever it is i'm seeing worldly recognition name and fame social media success or people uh talking about you through the word of mouth i'm seeing your name is being spread over and across it's because of uh your uniqueness so always put your unique side okay if you want to grow do, do not compare do not compete all you have to do is just bring that unique side into your work and the world will recognize you this is what is happening i'm seeing you coming out of your comfort zone you're starting a new chapter you're ready for a new beginning some of you are going to start something that's related to travel travel business real estate go ahead the world is at your feet but stay grounded okay another thing that i'm seeing is you're too scared of taking action at recently i feel maybe in the near future in the past you have been extremely closed off or uh, to the ultimate gates of happiness you wanted to open the doors but you were scared that what if this happens what if that happens you were too worried about the outcome okay the garden and the gate is telling me that you're too much in your comfort zone thinking about the risk but now you stop thinking about the risk you're envisioning your future 
and you're ready to go towards a leap of faith in the new direction in your life the gates are open you're ready to go ahead you're believing in the manifestation okay so this is what i'm seeing you can see the gate over here is closed and over here is open okay and you're going to experience a whole new world of happiness okay i'm seeing most of you are very young watching this okay maybe you're a youthful spirit you're a youthful soul you're a young soul even if you're 50s or 60s you're very young inside of your head okay so we have the no card which means that you're saying no to the things that do not stand uh right in your eyes in your in your mind and uh, that are not correct for you that are not healthy for you okay so the two of ones i'm seeing you're skipping something and going to something else some of you are thinking of career switch some of you are adding to your work expansion expanding in your field some of you are choosing a new career opportunity some of you are choosing a new place to uh, live some of you are meeting a new person in your life so i'm seeing you saying no to the past i'm seeing you saying no to something that is just triggering you and doing nothing else so finally you're moving ahead you're seeing beyond the world world twice which means that you're going ahead i'm seeing you meeting someone new it can be through social media as well now i'm seeing the six of cups i'm seeing the three of uh cups it means that you're going to build solid connections with the people that you're already in touch with like for example your siblings your brothers your sisters your uh, mother your father your husband or your wife or your girlfriend your boyfriend anyone that you have uh relations with I'm seeing also a reunion from the past is going to happen. Some childhood friends of yours will ask you to meet again. You will have a happy time, celebrating time, celebrate, celebrate, celebratory time. Uh, I'm also seeing that um, maybe your uh, friendships are getting more stronger. You're making uh, friends with people from the past, okay, just friendships whatever it is i'm seeing a gala time with the people that you're uh, connected to okay even if it's your pets i'm seeing you love them i'm also seeing it could be your family that you're going to get um closer to you're going out and celebrating with them okay this is reunion from someone from a long distance i feel maybe it's your best friend that's coming back from another country and meeting you and you guys are coming back in a reconciliation these are some examples okay all right so yeah i'm seeing there's a possibility of a friend of yours that's coming back from some long distance to reconnect with you it was a very strong connection you guys had was she or he was your best friend and uh, maybe you guys were besties and in the childhood time you guys have had a lot of fun and then suddenly you separated i feel this person is gonna reach out to you this is what i'm seeing all right the chariot i'm seeing things have started to move forward someone new is coming into your life if you haven't met this person yet i'm seeing you will be uh connecting with each other in a form of team you'll be working in a team that will bring a lot of progress i'm seeing your connections flourishing i'm seeing your relationships are getting more stronger i'm seeing your position is going up i'm seeing you're becoming more respected i'm seeing you buying a new car i'm seeing someone from the past that is your friend an old bestie is coming back with a uh, beautiful get together and a reconciliation so a lot of good things are happening in your life i'm seeing you building your own house making your money uh creating a solid foundation at work i'm seeing your worth is uh increasing your reputation is increasing your work is appreciated for sure okay so what else yes i'm seeing you getting the leadership position in the near future i'm seeing you're going to be the boss of your life trust me you're still a boss all you have to do is just believe in that kind of a mindset abundant mindset brings more success lack mindset brings more lack so i feel like you've changed your mindset become more abundant love is never in vain trust me there are a lot of people around you that love you that like you and will do anything for you you have friends you have family members you have kids you have your uh, colleagues i'm seeing everybody is appreciating you everybody is loving you did something okay You're spreading a lot of sweetness around as i told you write down the comment section love is all around me i am love and i'm loved okay so yes 
beautiful wow i'm seeing you're being in limelight you're in a limelight you're stealing the limelight you're stolen the show and everybody is looking up to you like you're the best you're glowing and you're on another level in life and feel like you are spreading your arms and your light is shining through the heart chakra which means you have the power of healing you have the power of renewing renewal that a scorpio is i'm seeing you shedding your old skin starting something new i'm seeing you started to believe in yourself i'm seeing you going to the another step in life a new beginning is definitely there you're going to shine people will look up to you but there is somebody you're like should i should i not should i should i not stop worrying about things Otherwise, get an amethyst for yourself. You worry too much. Please tell me more about this. Yeah, there is some worry in your life. It, it rega it's, it's in regards to the person that you're in love with or the person that you're going to meet or the fact that you're single and you want to settle down. Or if you are in a relationship, then you think that this person should pay more attention to you. I feel you're too worried about what other person does. You're, you should not be. You should be fully satisfied and complete within you. Okay? Other person should feel worried about you and not you. Okay? Let me just pull an advice for my beautiful Scorpio. Write down the comment section. I am happy and satisfied with my life. I'm the boss. Okay, give it to God. If something is stressing you out, you cannot change each and everything. You cannot change other people. You cannot change certain things around you. All you have to do is just believe in it. Leave it to the universe. Leave it to God. Exhale, release the stress and heal yourself. You will get your answers at the right time. So, yeah. Let me see the signs that you're dealing with or you're going to deal with. Someone is very attracted towards you. Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. Okay, we're dealing with a Gemini. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Capricorn, or Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Okay, what else? Yes, I knew it. There's someone very attracted towards you, and you're worried that this person might ditch you in the end of the day if you start believing in them. What the heck? It's your fault. Stop worrying. Just go with the flow, guys. Give it to God. If something has to happen, it will happen. I wish I could take back my words. I feel you said something to this person that hurt them or that uh, made them feel uh, they can't handle you or they're not capable of you. You're feeling bad about it. So, yeah, this is what I'm seeing. Okay. Or some of you are so attracted to a person of your interest, you, you cannot tell them your feelings and that is worrying you. Either ways, I'm seeing that is happening. But there's someone that is in your mind for sure. Okay, Scorpio, what else? Wow. Emotions are a natural and necessary part of your life, but it can distort your perception and cloud your vision so i feel like if you're keeping resentment with someone from your past you're still attracted to but you don't want to be with that person because they ditched you i feel you're just blurring your vision you have to understand that you have to keep your head over heart head should control your heart and not vice versa because that way you'll keep resentment and not be able to forgive and not be able to move on thereby so be very clear in your vision and the decisions that you make because that will decide your future Truth be told, yeah, I'm seeing there's someone's hiding their true intentions from you. You may not know today, but you will soon come to know the truth. Okay, what is that? Please tell me. Okay, knight or swords. Someone is deliberately trying to stop you from growing. Someone is very jealous of you. This person could be someone around you. It need not be your lover. It could be someone that keeps thinking about your uh, luck. They are jealous of your destiny. They're jealous that you're more happier, that you're more free, playful, happy, and enjoying your life. And there's someone that definitely feels jealous. Okay. So I'm seeing you're giving this person a hard time. But the truth is, you will remain who you are. So their truth is going to come out. Some of you, it, it could be an Aquarius. If you feel like uh, uh, you're interested in someone that ditched you in the past, is going to be the one. No. There's someone new that's coming into your life you will end up with. And this is your soulmate. Write down the comment section. I'm ready to meet my soulmate, my new love. I'm so ready. Okay, let me see one more message. 
wow this person is wealthy they make a lot of money okay that's your soulmate let um, me have just a little more messages about your soulmate yes this person is coming super fast okay and wow this is someone that is at a leadership position very authoritative strong and powerful personality very successful in such such a small age or they got success in a very uh, early time and this person is very smart shrewd political and possessive and caring towards you and wants to end up marrying you so they're highly stable and secure in their own position so all the best to you guys and do come back for more check out the link below for extended i'll see you back again like share comment and subscribe bye